welcome back to my channel. So today I am going to do a quite a big haul. It is going to be a new items for work as I start a new job soon. So I thought that I'll treat myself to a whole new wardrobe for work. So I have bought stuff from Pretty Little Thing and I've bought stuff from ASOS. So we're just going to unbox that together and also do a little bit of a trial on as well. So to start off with, we're going to go into our Acer. So the first thing is this cami with a square neck. I seriously don't even remember most of the stuff that I have bought because I bought it all last week and I do so much in between. I don't even remember. And I had to wait a while to film this video because one of the Pretty Little Thing packages was a bit delayed, so. Oh, this is quite nice. Okay, I remember this now. So it's just this sleeveless cami and it's got a square neck. So I thought that you can wear it with like a blazer or stuff on a day where it's a bit too hot or anything. You could just like layer it up because I'm all about layers. I get too hot and then I get too cold. So there's this nice black cami and it's got a little bit of a rib texture to it. I don't know if you can see the texture. Next we have this white crew top. It's from New Look, but obviously from ASOS. I don't remember this one, so this would be interesting. Well, yeah, it's just a normal plain white t-shirt just to put under anything. So like you had a nice skirt or a pair of trousers and you just wanted a plain top. Got a long sleeve because obviously we're going to be going into autumn and it is just all about layering up as well. Next thing is the fact that if you watch my channel then you kind of know that I'm more of a backpack person. I'm not really a handbag person so I feel like well I can't really start my new job going now with like my little mini backpack so I thought that I need to get an actual bag but then really fussy with bags but then I saw this one on ASOS and it was just so simple and it kind of went with something that I have bought from Pretty Little Thing as well and it kind of goes with my new um like suede biker jacket that I bought so it's like the colours kind of go and it's this bag here and it's just this bag it's like a nice beigey colour and it's just very simple and the fact is that I'm going to be having to travel into London a few times like with this job as well as working at the other office so I want something that is just going to be a bit big and I can put all my stuff in like my lunch and like whatever I need and it's not going to be on my back and the good thing about this bag is the fact that let's just take this little sticker off that is this little fastening and you open it up and it comes with a longer strap so you can have it over your shoulder or just down the side you don't have to always hold it like this and this is going to be my lifesaver because i don't want to hold it i'm not i don't like holding bags so inside it's got a lot of room it's got like a nice big zip there oh it's got like compartments so you can put your phone and stuff so this is actually a really nice bag, so I'm definitely gonna be keeping that. Let's move into Pretty Little Thing. I did two orders because the first order I did, well, at the same time I did the Asus one, when they were sending it out, one of the items was out of stock, so I had to go and obviously buy some more, um, a different version, so that's why there's two parcels. So we're gonna start off with the first one that arrived. First we're going to start off with this skirt, I am absolutely, it's a nice beige checkered skirt and this is more for the days that is going to be like a casual because I do know that it's a bit short, it's a lot shorter than I thought but it's going to be for like casual Fridays so I am literally going to be living my clueless fantasy in this skirt, I can just already tell. Next we are going to go on to these high-waisted pleated front detail trousers. Let's see. Mm, they're a lot thinner than 
they looked on the website like i can literally see through them and see to the outside the window that's how thin they are so i'm not too sure about these i'd have to try them on and they work out and they look completely different like they do have like the tailoring but they just don't look as nice as they did on the website if that makes sense like they just look like joggers but i don't know maybe the try on will like save them i just bought like some cycling shorts just to put on like if i wanted to do like a long shirt or something or just in general the fact that i had it was like 25 percent off the whole website so i just bought more cycling shorts this one i'm excited and i really hope that it actually looks really nice on it is a black it's a black blazer but it's got like frills let's just show you this would be like my first like proper blazer uh, oh look at that it's just got oh the arm detail it's just everything it's like it's got this. I'm so excited to try this on. I hope it actually looks good on because I'd be so disappointed if I have to send it back. But this with like a nice pair of fitted like work trousers, just be like sophisticated and like, oh, who's she bossing it? So this is definitely one I'm excited to try on. I went for like quite a few skirts because I don't really have that many skirts and I want to try go back into skirts and everything that I ordered I purposely ordered a size down as well because I obviously am um, if you've seen from a previous video I'm in like a workout routine now and like a calorie control diet as well I'm trying to just get myself in shape before the big id 3-0 next year <laughs> so I'm purposely ordering stuff to not be the size that i am now to give me motivation to get into the size that i want to be and then so on so this is another skirt and i'm loving the detail on this skirt and the packaging so let's open it up and show you this skirt can we talk about this skirt like look at the detail on this skirt Those little buttons are just amazing. Doesn't have any gift to it. So obviously like when we try it on, it may be a little bit tight, but don't forget this is why I purposely ordered stuff smaller so I can get into it and be like motivated to get into it. Next we're going to go into this. This is a jumpsuit and this jumpsuit looks so nice on the actual model. And it was in the sale and an obviously pretty little thing had its own other sale on top and the jumpsuit was eight pound like eight pound for the jumpsuit and I couldn't leave it. The color is a little bit out there for me, for my wardrobe. Like I know I'm wearing mustard, but like this is just, this is brown and I don't really wear brown. Yeah, I don't really wear brown. I had to look to see like, mm, isn't that skirt brown, but it's not. So, but I thought for like work, it would be a nice color and then I really stickly on my skin, it should be nice. Oh, there's the belt that's come off. But the material is quite nice, quite thick. Oh, she nice. So this is what it looks like. Obviously we're gonna do try on. So it's got this nice collar to it. This is why I thought it would be nice for work. And then obviously it's got this belt that goes around the middle. Oh actually quite nice and quite fit hopefully it fits i've got it in a large but she looks a little bit small and i've got wide hips and a wide bust so we'll see about that then we've got a black jersey a v-neck long sleeve i think this is just like a plain black top I'm not too sure i've got so many tops that are for work anyway this was more about getting the bottoms like the skirts and the trousers so then in the try on section if you see me with um like 
if you see me with tops that aren't from this that is why because i've already got loads of tops oh this is quite loose oh no this is the black dress this was a black dress which looked on the model she looked like she was ready to be the boss and to serve and hey she probably was the boss like and it's long sleeve and it's thin like not too thin but i think for work you'd have to wear a vest top underneath it because it's thin and it goes in at the waist to be fair but i thought this with a nice like blazer or some nice heels would be really nice for work and then the thing is what i wanted to do as well is that i wanted to not get stuff that was purposely just for work like where i could like mix and match it like the skirt 100 percent can be used for everyday wear like, last thing in this one is another skirt and this one's got more buttons on it i was just living for the skirts on pretty little thing and it shows so this one is this like ready like tweed style it's really nice with some nice tights and some sock boots it could be so nice for work and it's got these button details that go all the way down the middle so moving on to the next pretty little thing bag this one's got two pairs of trousers because as i said the last one was the first order and there was trousers missing out of that because obviously everyone went on and bought clothes during the sale so i had to go and buy some more but complaining i was after there was two tops on there that i was like need so the first pair of trousers are these nice tan beigey ones and this is the tan crepe super high-waisted skinny trousers if you don't know by now i love high-waisted trousers they're just my ultimate favorite thing oh these are nice and thick oh these are nice and these are in the sale as well oh and they've got pockets yes I love a pocket. Oh, these are really nice. Oh. Next, we're gonna go for this top. I bought this top more for like an evening top or like maybe a daytime top, but more evening. It wasn't necessarily part of this, but we'll we'll still try it on and see because you never know. But I don't think it will be for work because it's like corset style so i don't think that would be for work i'll just show you so you understand what i'm on about but it was in the sale i really liked it it was like gothic chic and i was like need that in my life it's so nice like look at it it's like this sheer black top and then it's got this corset that goes around the waist maybe you can wear it for work you might be able to get away with it to be fair and it's got like the nice frills on the sleeves do you know we'll put it with like something and then you'll be able to see it and see what you think and the whole back is like a zip this would be interesting the last pair of trousers are these nice gray are they gray or like stone yeah gray and these are paperback trousers oh these are so nice the thing is i didn't see these on the website at the beginning so this is them they've got the ties so you can tie it up oh and this one i remember this one now it has like the nice buckle so that's going to be so cute and i forgot about these they've got little turn ups at the bottom so very work aesthetic yes you seem really big but i'm not complaining because oh they're really big when they get on my bum they're gonna probably just be like so who knows and the last thing that we've got is this top and it's a black polka dot i know it seems like i've got a lot of black stuff but i do have other clothes <laughs> like i do have other tops it's just that realistically black is my favorite color so i'm probably thinking about wearing this on my first day and i'm i might do a get ready with me for my first day at work 
comment down below if you'd like to see that video and then I will do that because I start in a couple of days so I can do that but this top and it comes with a nice waistband as well to tie up and it's a wrap top so you will have to wear a vest top underneath well I will because I've got big boobs and they're not popping out at work and the sleeves like amazing the sleeves have got like little ruffles to them so they look so cute so i might wear this to my first day oh it's just so adorable so this outfit's got the cami top and the high-waisted beige trousers and i'm absolutely loving these beige trousers they're so comfortable and this is what it just looks like with the cami you can see the tie detail with the waistband and with the pockets actually quite nice we're going to put the blazer on now just to see what it all comes together like this blazer is so nice i love the arm details of it being like the little puffy sleeves and the frilly bit it just gives so much shape and it fits so nicely like i'm glad that i got this size and didn't get a size bigger because this size absolutely fits perfectly what do you guys think of it let me know. Do you like it? Do you rate it? Or do you not like it? I actually love it. Woo! Cue the clueless moment. I'm absolutely in love with this skirt. It is amazing. It fits nicely. Obviously, remember why I bought certain sizes. And this is so nice. Obviously, I'm wearing the same cami. I'm going to wear the same cami for all the skirts that we're about to try on. Let's just look at what this skirt looks like with the bag. This is what it looks like with the bag. I've still got the wrapper on the handle, but I am absolutely loving it. Should we put the other handle on? So obviously it's got the adjustable strap, but this is what it looks like if you was to have it how I would have it. Cute, right? Like it, it's a good size. And I like the fact it comes up higher. I hate the ones when they come down so low. Okay. So I just put the cami back on and I put these trousers on and I'm actually liking these trousers. At first I wasn't, but now that I've actually put them with this top, they actually are really nice and I really like the buckle detail and the turned up ankles. I just really feel like that these are really nice. It's like they've got obviously the paper bag style here and then um, yeah, the only thing about the buckle is the fact that at the back, this waistband is actually sewn in at the back. So it doesn't really give you that much. So I would probably say if you're gonna get these, maybe go down a size. Like, if you want them a little bit tighter, but I think these are really nice to be fair. So here is the corset top. Unfortunately, there's a lot of cleavage going on, so this is definitely not a work top. And if it was, you'd have to wear a vest top underneath. But it is really cute. But this is one top that is definitely the goal top to get into after this diet because this is tight. I mean tight. And of course it's not even fully done. It's like but I do love it so much. Obviously, this is to say if you want to return it, so ignore that. But I do love the detail of the frills here and the boobage area. But obviously, obviously once you lose weight, it'll probably like sneak shrinking a bit. Or I've just got too big a boobs. I need to decide if I'm going to return it and get a bigger size or just return it completely. I think it needs to be in a bigger size. I'm not. I need to decide on it. But I do love the detail. Like it's very me and. There's just so much boobies going on, it's unbelievable. Yeah, but it's really cute. I really do love it. These are the trousers that I wasn't too sure about and I'm still not too sure about because they just don't look like what was on the website and I don't know where to keep them. They don't do anything for this section. They do not flatter at all. This is where it's defining. Like there's some odd pleats that are just here and just, it's not a good look. So we've got one more top left to try and let's go do that now. So this is the last top. This is the one that I'm thinking about maybe wearing on my first day just because
because I like the print. I like the little detail with the sleeves. I did have to put a cami underneath because it's very widely open. Like it doesn't, it's not because of my boobs or anything. It's just literally the style of it. So I think with this one, you have to wear a cami on or have like boob tape. And for work, I'd rather have a cami. And I do love the waistband that you can add on and then tie a little bow. But again, teamed with these trousers, not the one. I feel like they're gonna go back because this whole section is just not flattering at all. So fortunately, two of the skirts didn't fit, but I'm keeping like the brown one with the gold buckles at the top. And I'm not gonna keep the one, the red one. I really didn't like it once I tried putting it on. It just the button details weren't really flattering that much. And that jumpsuit, do you remember I said that it looked small, even though it was the large? That thing would not go over these fires, and I was there was no way I was gonna be keeping that. So that's going back. So we couldn't unfortunately show those today in the video. But if you like this little haul video and try on, this is my first ever try on, so please like be nice, like I've never done one before. I really, I'm not that big of a fan of my body, so it's like, please be nice. But if you like this video, then please get a thumbs up and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and the bell so you don't miss out on any other videos because there's videos going up every Tuesday, Thursday and Sunday. So make sure you check out all the other videos. Until next time, bye!